Demon Slayer Swordsmith Village Episode <laughs> 5. Yep. And like, we're back. I felt like I said sword like sword bitch. Oh, you did. Shit. I didn't I didn't really, you know, say much about it. But anyway, so last episode, we just got finished seeing some crazy shit. Um, Moon number four decided to split up into a bunch of different pieces as you know two episodes ago and Tondro and then were catching hell trying to fight him Ginyu's looking like he's doing some crazy shit like he's clearly not human like I yeah. said he stabbed him many times you know so I wonder what that's and about. he was praying too it'd be actually cool actually if he was always resisting turning you know whatever oh, he's yeah. turning just because of the prayer alone which is that, what I feel like I was gonna say that'd be pretty cool yeah right um <laughs> And Tondro did some like big brain shit with like knocking the other one back into yeah, the Yeah, using the other one's foot yeah. to uh, be able to grab the pole and you get the point. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mitsuru or M- Mitsuri or whatever. What was that? Um, the love hush. Oh, the she wife. She pulled up, you know, at the other Yeah, with them where thick I think thighs. Five, you know, number five was. was yeah, right, with but, number five. <laughs> right. All right. Let's just jump into it. With moments like that, I'm just like, I'm cool with all the other shit that was in the opening. Yes. Yeah. Don't show me the sword, though. I don't want to see that till it's, you know. I'm skipping the next one. <laughs> These are the next open. <laughs> yeah. You better remember they said that. Oh, fuck. That is. He stopped him from dying. Honestly, if I was him, I'd slice the uh, jar. You gotta be careful with that, though. I feel like. Yeah, sure. Oh, he's farther than I thought. Smart. That's why he told them to stop right before actually going there, you know. Yeah. They would have got jumped. He should have used a get too good Tensho. It's a long range attack. I wonder how many he's killed. Gyotaro was at like, I think he killed 21 or 17, something like that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm sure at five, he's probably in the 20s. If not more. Oh! Nobody saved him. He couldn't. Sharpening blades, my guy. You would think some of them would know how to fight. Probably been a smart thing to do, but they sort of messed for a thick thighs. Never lie. Ankles. It's gonna be hard watching her fights. Paying attention anyway. Especially if they have some physics, which they should do. Damn. Damn. I sure for a reason, alright? <laughs> He understands. I'd be scared to leave anywhere else. Like, what the fuck are we about to... Oh, fuck! Yo, I hope they don't kill him. Bro, he just got squeezed and the juice came out. Why'd you like call a it juice? Box. juice. surprised if he doesn't honestly damn bro being a grunt in this universe is starting to look deadly yeah <laughs> fucking sword whip she into some kinky shit <laughs> stop you're black damn it that's true <laughs> just be glad i'm glad the mo- enemies she's fighting aren't black That's a wild ass weapon. I wonder at what point she started trying to use that instead. And who decided it? Definitely her. Come on, give me something good. I don't even know why I'm asking. Damn. I feel like they capture the vibe they want you to capture with yeah. her so well. I don't even know how to explain what she just felt like. She feels very um anime schoolgirl here. Like yeah, I was gonna say what you tend to see stereotypically. So I'm sure there's more depth to her character, but he's probably in heaven now. <laughs> see, I was right. <laughs> I guess he just got a few broken ribs or something. <laughs> and she gets flustered so goddamn easily. <laughs> well, I guess it's a good thing somewhat they were wearing masks now. Yeah. Because otherwise you just got seen. 
Oh shit. Let's go carrying the team. Literally. She got fucking fried. You know what I love about Tanjiro's development through this show? What? They've been doing it through a lot through, like, experience. Oh, yeah, it's not just like, yo, snap your finger and you know what the hell to do. Yeah, he doesn't just go through one magic training and now he can fight half the balloons. Yeah. Know? He's been getting his ass whooped for three seasons. Mm, okay, I get it. Blood art. Yeah, probably putting it on his sword to make yeah. it, you know. Kind of like, um, remember when he's fighting Rui, it came up. Yeah. Uh, he landed on his sword like that. Yeah. It has different pots with all different types of shit in it. Creative, though. What the fuck is that? Are those all the people he eat? He ate. Yo, this show got dark as shit in comparison the past episode. Yeah. So. Holy shit. This dude's fucking sick. Not in a good way. I think way. sick is a... Uh... They're still alive? That's oh, nah, he got this man down. Hell yeah. I did notice the one dude was still twitching after he pushed him out of his, you know, gourd or whatever, or uh, pot. Then he was like some type of performer. Possibly, yeah, I can see that. He was really going into details about this. No. Oh! Bro, just kill him. Fuck. Really highlights the evilness, though. Yeah. <laughs> now I want them dead. So the yeah. win. Or the mist, I guess. He's out here insulting people? You get a personality. He's gonna go right? Yeah, I was about Ooh. to say. He's five for a reason. Yeah, yeah, I expect him to be fast. Fuck your artwork. Damn! <laughs> well, there's your idea right there. But the thing is, if they're, like, basically magic bases, he probably has ten billion of them. How mm -hmm. do you even... I wonder if he has some type of limit. Definitely has to. I love the characters in the show. Mm. Forgot who's got of course it's poison. It always. I was just about to ask, too. I'm just like, all right, is, do all of them have poison? Exactly. But I was just going to say, too, I'm like, how small he is, too. Because those needles looked a lot smaller. But... Yeah. Maybe the first one he killed. 
Definitely would have killed his family. Damn! Oh, this is about to be really good. This man pulled a Zabuza on him. This is rare for this episode and the last episode. The pacing is really slow. Like, not yeah. in a bad way, but like strangely that they don't usually do. It's not time yet. There you go. Yo, add it to the fucking flame. Oh, that's uh, fucking cool as shit. Already by itself. Another memory. <laughs> Your great 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 grandmother, my guy. No, nah, fuck that. She was kind of fine, though. Uh, yeah, you're telling us. I'm just in that too, and uh, you know, skin is hard. Yeah, yeah, symbolism. I told you, Goku all the way to the side. Come on, do your shit. The head's getting cut right off, and he's slicing through this shit. Oh, yeah, but then again, I think he has to cut the tongue, is what it was, or something like that. Come on, Tanjiro. <laughs> they ain't the only one with inherited memories. Should've fully did it. Woo, he using it twice? Woo, do it! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Fucking terrifying. Oh, <laughs> you see this shit? Ooh, the animation! Back to the back, bro. I did not expect him. Oh, shit. Look at that. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I fucking love it. I did not expect him to go after all of them. I fucking like that. love it. They better be dead fully. Just my God, it's the tears again. They've happened. Just at one moment, that was so fucking hype. <laughs> when he gripped that sword, his sword did turn. Yeah. Yeah. I love that he always ends up remembering this. You know. It's not yeah, and, and the thing is, once again, it's like one of those things, like you say, it's a realistic. Experience and realistic step forward. Uh, once he knows, once he does it once, he's like, all right, now I can kind of remember. And I build off of that. And funny thing is, it wasn't once. He had to train, too. Damn. Damn right. <laughs> Don't die. Oh! Okay, so, yeah, not human like we thought. Yeah. Didn't think he'd have to fight him. I thought his hair looked. I was like, when did he have blonde highlights in his hair? Yeah. yeah. That yeah. episode was just beautiful. That was fucking great. First off, like I said, it's been moving a lot slower pace and not like in a bad way. You know, we're not going, um, uh, well, fuck it. I'll just say it. we're not going One Piece currently or old yeah. Dragon Ball Z here. Where it's and, just like, yeah. Or, or, and when I say currently, I don't mean like this episode. I just meant like how One Piece, you know, doesn't really tend to adapt a lot. Of yeah. Per episode. But, um, 
and that's kind of rare for the show to slow My down like God. that, you know? The, the animation at that point when he used the, the sun... I think it's a potato sun technique. God Halo. Yeah. God that. Halo Dragon. Some, some I'm just going to call it Sun, sun Potato Halo Guy. And then it's just like the the fire mixed with the fire and stuff like that. And then they slice. Oh, my God. You didn't know is. what you were just saying just now, did Exactly. You? <laughs> <laughs> but first and foremost, animation was fucking clean. Yeah, it okay. was clean as fuck. I thought that in when I saw the trailer for last se- you know, for this season, like yeah. last year, I thought that was going to be him doing Rengoku's Purgatory thing. Yeah. He was going to be practicing. And at the same time, that actually did remind me of that in the first place, though. You know? Um, kind of makes me wonder if Rengoku kept his... Let's say all the Flame Hashira were actually part of the Rengoku family. And that was something they actually created, which is why, again, it was Rengoku. Because people are like, oh, he named it after himself. I'm like, well, y'all gotta remember that was his last name, though, yeah. too. You know? Even though I think it means, like, Purgatory or something like that. Which is cool as fuck. It is. Know? It's cool as shit. But, ultimately speaking, it makes me wonder if that move was made off of that. That he just did. Yeah, I was gonna say because all of them take from the uh, the sun breathing yep. basically. So if they saw uh, Yurichi do that, and then they're just like, "Well, fuck, I can't do that." But what am I? What else am I gonna do? And that's how that move from Goku uh, came about in the first this place. This still brings cool, up the actually. fact that he was having memories of him, um, Muzan's memories and stuff like that. And then the thing is, just like, all right, so number one looks exactly like him. Mm. What is the relationship between that move on? I, I still bad. think it's not going to be him, and it's going to be like a fake out type yeah. moment, basically. Because, like I said, I'm like I'm always wary about like them showing us stuff without necessarily that saying. or some type of possession of some sort, bro. And rewatching the show and like other people's reactions is honestly a good point for like theories and different things. Oh yeah, you know, it really gets you thinking when you rewatch a show, you know, even outside of people's reactions. But the one thing, like I said, it's always the Tanjiro's dead thing. Yeah, that and one went that out the window. That guy was Tanjiro's dead. You know, it's the, like, the, yeah, the, yeah, you know, because he's definitely. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's I like because he's definitely 300 years old. And that's what I said. I'm like, bro, pay attention to the to the years. Yeah. That doesn't even make any sense. If Yorichi was from 300 years ago, like they said, how the fuck would that be his dad? Unless his dad's a demon and he's been living that long. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but the, it still wouldn't make any sense because he would have met his mom while he was still human 40 40 years ago. So. Hey, look, how you know his mom was human? A- anyway, so <laughs> it, listen, <laughs> don't. There's any spoilers in the comments. But, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. And I know some of you guys may be wondering about, like, this back here and everything. Well, we're trying some stuff out, you know. We don't have exactly, like, a green wall. But we've been trying out some green screen type stuff, you know. So, if you see it being green, that means something actually went wrong. We have to fix some <laughs> stuff. And, look, it is what it is, you know. Uh, but if you actually see it and it's, like, you know, a real background or whatever, you know, I guess it ended up working out. We're, we're going to kind of, like, fix it over time. It's a little hard to do with the shadows and things. But anyway, we want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And we will check you guys out later.